Another tool that's used to apply herbicides to trees is something called a tree injector. And these were commonly used in, in the past and are widely available. There's a number of different types of them. This is one right here called a Cranko. Uh, it has a blade at the bottom. The handle or tube itself uh, contains the herbicide. You fill it with the herbicide. And there's a pump mechanism that would squirt that herbicide out on top of this blade. And you simply took the tree injector and stuck it into the tree like, like you would a hatchet and squirted the fluid uh, or the herbicide uh, into that slit and work yourself around the tree and apply the herbicide that way. These tree injectors are, are no longer available. Uh, at least the tree injectors that have the liquid um, chemical or used to apply the liquid chemical. There is a tree injector that's now available um, called the EasyJECT. Uh, and it's a tree injector that applies herbicide in a dry formula formulation. And, and I'll show you um, what, what this injector is gonna, gonna stick into the tree. Um, this, the chemical comes, or the herbicide comes, in granular and soluble form uh, in this casing here. And um, these easy jets will hold 400 of these casings. You buy them, you can buy a couple different types of chemical in them. Um, and you can, you can order these from, from forestry supply houses uh, and, and get the chemical. Uh, and the way this works is uh, the easy eject, very similar to an old tree injector, uh, but in this case, it's gonna stick the, um, the casing into the tree, just like it did here. And, and you can see where it stuck that in there. Uh, and then over time, that chemical will solubilize and, and uh, be moved into the tree. And you, you, you work your way around the tree and you, the, uh, the chemical will have, the particular chemical that you're using uh, will specify how many of these need to be applied per diameter of tree or spacing around the circumference and that kind of thing. And so it's a good way of, of being very, uh, being able to accurately apply a chemical. Um, you, don't have, uh, you don't have the liquid mess, if you will, or the mixing and that kind of thing that needs to be done um, with using standard chemicals. Um, it is more expensive uh, and it can actually take more time uh, than, than applying liquids. Uh, but it is an option for some species that you might want to treat in some conditions and the forester can help advise you on that.